Simon McCowan, The Story of Invalid Carriages The history of the bright blue NHS disability car is not a simple story of automobiles. Following World War I and World War II, the UK government supplied invalid carriages to injured war veterans. With the arrival of the NHS in 1948, the general disabled population also benefited. Invalid carriages were once a common sight on British roads with over 25,000 registered on British roads in 1975. Invalid carriages were however hard to use, unreliable and dangerous. They were slow and offered limited comfort or warmth. Critically, no passengers were allowed which meant disabled drivers were isolated from their families. Constructed by famous UK engineering companies such as AC, and despite being problematic, they provided independence for working-class disabled people over many years. Invalid carriages were quickly phased out by the government in 1975, following a disabled-led campaign which led to the development of the current Motability Disabled Vehicle Scheme. Simon McCowan is an artist, academic and director of the Invalid Carriage Register. He's also a keen collector of these vehicles with over 20 examples in his collection. In 2018, he launched his National Lottery Heritage Funded research project entitled The Carrying of Passengers is Forbidden. The research aims to uncover the hidden history and heritage of the invalid carriage and its users.